Hello, thank you for joining me for Hope for Today. You know, the last couple weeks at church, we've talked about the importance of availability. And then yesterday, we talked about the importance of spiritual gifts and the fact that each of us are gifted. We all have gifts and abilities that God has deposited into our lives. Paul tells us in 1 Corinthians chapter 12 and verse 1, he tells us that concerning spiritual gifts, brethren, I do not want you to be unaware or ignorant or He doesn't want us to not know about spiritual gifts. Spiritual gifts are important. And he outlines in chapter 12, 13, and 14 a lot of spiritual gifts, what they are, what they're for. And I think a lot of times people get way too caught up in the spiritual gifts themselves instead of just the attitude behind the spiritual gifts. And as we learned yesterday, our spiritual gifts are not necessarily for us. God has given them to us to be a blessing to other people and to bring him honor and glory. And so I want to encourage you, use your spiritual gifts, develop them, let God use you and don't make excuses of, well, I've done this in my life or I'm too old or I'm too young. We looked at Samuel a couple of weeks ago. Samuel was 12 years old and God was speaking to him. And so it doesn't matter who you are. It doesn't matter what you've done. If you're a believer, God has deposited gifts into your life. And if you're not using those gifts and you're not contributing to the kingdom of God through those gifts that God has given to you, I want to encourage you to use those gifts because that's part of the discovery of God's will for your life and also living out God's purpose in your life.